The United Nations said on Tuesday that sustainable cooling must be treated as essential infrastructure to cut greenhouse gas emissions, save lives and reduce costs, as it launched a report at the COP30 climate talks. With typhoons tearing across Southeast Asia and areas of Jamaica and Brazil still clearing debris from damaging storms, UN officials called for energy efficient solutions that lower the carbon footprint of cooling. We can't air condition our way out of this heat crisis. We have to, if we do that, then we will just drive up greenhouse gases, raise costs, cause grid overload and uh, essentially peak demand. Instead, we have to think about smart buildings, affordable cooling, ambient cooling, ambient infrastructure, integrating the environment into the urban setting while cutting energy sectors and the carbon footprint of the cooling itself. Meanwhile, protesters carrying signs reading our forests are not for sale broke through security lines of the COP30 climate talks on Tuesday night. It is the first time the climate conference is being held in Brazil with delegates from almost 200 countries attending the talks taking place in Belém on the edge of the Amazon rainforest.